So hi all you YouTubers, all you Facebookers, everybody who just watches my video. Which thank you by the way. Makes me feel so much special when I go on Facebook and I see all these comments. Makes me happy. Um so I must be like the only lame who does not know how to ducky. So this is like a challenge for everybody. You should make me a video teaching me how to duggy. And no, I don't want to watch the music video. No. Make me your own version so I can learn easier. Okay? Um, so, if you do it, I'll be happy. If you don't do it, well, guess what? You suck. Okay? Um, let's see what else is there. I am not sauced anymore. Well, maybe just a little, but I'm getting over it. Um, I, my mood right now is just, I'm not happy. I look happy. I always look happy. But I'm not happy. I'm sad. I don't know how to frown, so. That's not even a frown. Wait. I'm sad. Not, that was nasty. Um. So we have school tomorrow, and summer is technically summer's not really over yet. Um, you know, first day of fall hasn't come yet, but technically, you know, like summer break is over. But um, I'm gonna be optimistic, and I'm gonna just say that I have like a week left of summer break, cause. I don't see what's the point. We have a half a day tomorrow, no school Thursday or Friday, and then school starts on Monday. Like, we have a four day weekend and a half a day tomorrow. What's the point in that? But whatever. So, school starts next Monday. So, get everything you can done in this last week that you have free. And yes, I'm playing with a stuffed snake. I love stuffed animals. Um, that's my Slurpee. It's red now, but it was red and white. It's something cherry, not wild cherry, something cherry. So this was a G. And then it was pina colada. And then I add my special ingredient to it. Um, you know, added some water. <laughs> water. Um, how long is this video? This video's only been three minutes. I'm really speechless today. Like, that's weird. I'm always talking. Oh! <laughs> this lady <laughs> in the supermarket. I don't know. I asked. I can't remember what. Like, it was the other day. I can't remember what I asked her for, but I bought this toy for my niece. And then I asked her for something, and I can't remember it. And so then, without me looking, I picked it up. I, like, I didn't pick it up. Like, I just, I took everything and put it in the bag, whatever. And then I got home, and then I looked at it, like, instead of giving me what I asked her for, she gave me this. Fucking, what is it? Intimacy gel. Like, chick. <laughs> this is not what I asked you for. The hell? Yeah, I, I need gel. Ugh, I'm not even going to get into it. Like, that shit is just nasty. I'm like... What the hell is that? Um, I went to Ali's, which is like my favorite restaurant ever. Favorite like Asian restaurant. They're not Chinese. They were Vietnamese, but then they got taken over by, I don't know if Thailand people or Taiwanese, whatever. It's a Thai place. So, I like their roast pork bun. That's what it was called in the Vietnamese place. Now they call it bao. Some shit like that. So, fine, I ordered it. They used to have really, really big ones. Then they had two medium ones. And now they have three really tiny ones. I saw her, I said, don't you make the big ones anymore? She goes, oh yeah, we still make the big ones. But instead of telling me she she that the, the meat is different. So instead of roast pork, is regular pork. But 
Pork doesn't taste like that. I know what pork tastes like. I love pork. And that shit tasted nasty. <laughs> Instead, she gave me this big, ugly, disgusting looking shit. It was like brown. It looked like it looked like shit. Like literally, <laughs> it looked like shit. And I didn't know what to do. <laughs> I was like, do I take it back and tell her this is not what I thought it was? Do what do I do with it? Do I throw it away? And so I just I decided I was like, whatever, I'm gonna take it home. Whoever wants to eat it, good luck like bust the luck to them. And then the next day I went back and I asked her and I was like, so what's the difference between the big one and the small one? And she goes, Oh, it's just made with different meat. I'm like, what do you mean different meat? She's like, the small one's made of roast pork and the big one's made of regular pork. But in my head, I'm like, bitch, I know what pork tastes like and I know what pork smells like and I know what pork looks like. And it was none of the three. <laughs> but I didn't say that because, you know, I'm a respectful person for the most part. Unless you piss me off. But, um, I was like, okay, and I just smiled at her, and she gave me one of her little, like, chinky Asian smiles, and it was adorable. And so then I just ordered the tiny small ones, and I had to order two, which is, like, three times the cost that it would be if we was back at the Vietnamese, the, blah, 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 <laughs> the Vietnamese place, and I ordered one regular big one. But, whatever. <sighs> um, what else? I'm kind of like stressing a little bit because, okay, so two days ago, I ordered pizza from Papa John's, which by the way, I hate Papa John's, and Papa John's, you suck. Anyway, I ordered pizza from them. Fine. The dude brought the pizza. Simple, everything, you know, casual routine. Um, fine. So then, not only did he upset me. I gave him a $5 tip, and he goes, that's it? What do you mean that's it? It's walking distance. If I wanted to go get it myself, I would, but you know I'm lazy. It's one pizza. You're not carrying a soda. You're not carrying nothing else. One pizza. I gave you $5. I should be giving you two. And then he goes, that's it. Like, you have some nerve. Anyway, so then fine. And then yesterday, I go to my account because I want to see how much money do I have left so that I could do my hair, my nails, and buy my costume for Halloween. Because, you know, I'm going to be Lady Gaga. And if any of you bitches from my school steal my idea, I'm going to fuck you up. Okay? Thank you. Um, so, I went to my account and Papa John's took their money three times. In a row. <laughs> like, they didn't even try to be sneaky about it. Took their pe their money three times. I'm like, since when did one piece of cost $60? Like, let me know. <laughs> I'll make my own fucking pizza. So, I got tired about that. And then yesterday, I called Chase to see if what they'll do about it, whatever. And they go, oh, I'm sorry. It's a national holiday. Okay. I let it go, Labor Day, whatever. But then why are you there? <laughs> like I call and you pick you answer the phone like hello, what can I do for you? If it's a holiday, why the fuck are you there? Why are you working? What are you sitting there telling people it's a holiday for? Why not just send it straight to voicemail? Whatever. I'm not the owner, I don't care. So then I call today. And I'm like, okay, let me see if they'll answer me. I called twice. First time, I hung up because the dude was like from fucking Pakistan, whatever. He sounded like a fucking terrorist. I couldn't understand shit that was coming out of his mouth. I'm like, hello, can you help me? He's like, oh, just one minute. I'm like, one minute, what are you doing? I didn't even give you any information yet. What the hell? And then, like, when I told him my problem, he's, like, talking, and I'm just, like, English? Can you speak in English, please? Like, I don't understand you. And then, fine. So, I hung up on him. And the second time, I called. And not to be racist or anything, but this prissy white bitch answered the phone. Fine. I tried to tell her my problem. 
I'm very respectful, very, very respectful when talking to strangers, elderly people, just respectful altogether. And she goes, um, just hold one minute, please. I'm like, okay, no problem. And so then, two minutes later, she comes back and she goes, hello. I'm like, hello. And then she hangs up the phone on me like, bitch, I know you heard me. You ain't slick. Whatever. Oh, I'm just so, so stressed out right now. Because, like, now I have to pay in cash instead of paying my, with my cards to do my hair, which is bad. It's, well, it's not bad, but, like, I like my, my debit card rewards. Like, every time you suck your card and you pay for something, you get a point with every dollar that you spend, which is awesome. But, um, so now I have to pay with cash. And now I don't even have enough money in my account to buy my costume. I have to wait till they give me my money back. Or until I get my paycheck. <laughs> anyway, um. <sighs> I don't know, I'm just so stressed out. And then I found out that my friend is getting locked up, and then that sucks, because then I'm going to miss him. And then I know when I get to school tomorrow, it's going to be mad drama. And I just hope nothing pops off, you know? Like, I'm not in the mood. It's still summer to me. Like, I'm still in my summer mode. I don't, see, I'm wearing my shades right now. I'm still in my summer mode. I don't want to have to, like, pop off to somebody, and it's summer. Like, it's time to relax. Just enjoy the weather. Which, by the way, it's getting cold. It's getting really cold. <laughs> like last night, the window was like slightly open. The air conditioners was off. My, I have a fan in my room that's really, really good. It, like when it was like a hundred degrees outside, my room was freezing. It, that's how good my fan is. I had my fan off, and my room was still cold. And my room is the hottest room in the house. But, um, I was just freezing. And so then my mom comes in my room. She goes, what's wrong with you? I'm like, I'm cold. She goes, I can see you're blue. <laughs> I'm like, how am I blue? She goes, like, your face is blue. I'm like, do I look like a popsicle? Do I look like a fucking icicle to you? <laughs> but, um, uh, again, I'm stressed. I don't know anymore. So, oh, this is my first, like, it's not dedicated to anybody. I just feel like talking, you know, this is my first, like, vlog. That's what I'm calling it. I'm calling it a vlog. It's my first vlog. So, yeah. This is the Dulce Show, like, you're on my account watching my videos for a reason, okay? Um, so don't get mad by anything that I say. It's, I don't mean it offensively. If I curse too much for you, um, two. There's two things you can do about it. Or there's two things I have to say to you. One, get the fuck off. Okay? Secondly, I could be really, really upset. That's probably why I curse so much. Because I don't, I don't really curse like that. Like, in general. There's something like I'm upset or... It's just like something that irks me, okay? Um, also, if I say something offensive, like when I got mad at that white lady who, <laughs> who answered the phone, I don't mean it, like a racist thing, it's nothing like that. I'm just mad, okay? Anything that I say offensive that offends you, I'm sorry in advance, okay? So this video, just let this video be known that I don't mean it that, like that, okay? Great. Um, what else did this do? What else did this do? Oh, I got my, my video from Netflix because I watch Who Framed Roger Rabbit so much that my own video just like it has the circle of death on it. Like, <laughs> it's scratched in a perfect circle. Oh, well. Um, so I got a video from Netflix, Who Framed Roger Rabbit, but as I just said. And I'm going to go watch my sexy ass wife, Jessica Rabbit, right now. 
Because, like, oh, if you can bang a cartoon character,